Alrighty guys, it's Christmas day. So Gina and I, we are out. I finally convinced him to come out with me so we can be stupid at the park and tr test out my Ozark trail. This so was a four person tent? I don't know, let's see. We tried doing it in the house um, because he didn't want to come outside, but it proved to be a little bit difficult because one, our living room is not that spacious. It's a little spacious, but not that spacious. Two, the uh, the tent poles, we tried to put them up together. It was a little too long and it wouldn't flex. So he caved in. Yeah, things are gonna make her happy, huh? Well, shit, you better. It's Christmas Day. Like, I want to stay home and be comfortable. There's no staying home and being comfortable on Christmas no. Day. It's for us to be right, bored and stupid and just spend some quality time together. So I will get back to you guys once we go to the park and pick out a spot. So, <laughs> alright guys, I think we found a spot. We even got Gio with us. So, it'll just be us three goofing around in the park today. Alright, let's find a good spot, set everything up. Let's get it started. Someone's excited to be in the park. You better not pee in my bag, I'm watching you. Hey! Bag. <laughs> what are you doing? Gio, you ready to get started? Or are you just gonna stand there and eat grass? Huh? Ready to get started? No? Having too much fun? He's gonna eat grass. <laughs> Hi, husband. You wanna help me set up the tent? Well, it's really your project, but I'll help you. I just... All right, so let me set this That's thing up. <laughs> so let me set this thing up on a tripod and let's get going. Alright guys, let's get started. cover that also has the vestibule part so this only took us like 10 minutes because we were goofing around and he took forever to help me but let's get the other piece on let's get the other piece on oh my god
Okay, so I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen states. Gio, come you don't, here. You don't necessarily need to use all come of them. Come here. There's extras. Come here. Gio, come here. Come. Come over here. Come here. Eat the grass over here. This is the grass. The grass is not green on the other side. God. Should put him in a tent. Gio, Gio, come here. I need you to stay where we are. Please. Yeah, put him under there. Put him in the He's tent. Put him in the tent. He'll be good. <laughs> He's not gonna. <laughs> So I'm just kind of lazy. My fingers are getting cold, so we, uh, we just rigged it up real quick, right there. Like I'm not even gonna stake down the rest, but this is pretty big, pretty darn big. Here's one entrance. As you see, there's a the palm paracord is on there. You can actually roll it up and have the thingy inside here. Go inside. Come on, Gio. Hi, Gio. My Ijo Ijo baby. Gio, sit. Here. That's your first time inside a tent, my baby. Sit, sit, sit. You want to lay it? Aww. You having fun in there, Gio? Huh? Is it cute? Is it cool? Yeah? Okay. Okay, so you have both entrances of the vestibule. It's actually really big, really, really spacious. So you got one entrance here. All right, and then you have the other entrance here. You can find the zipper and zip it up. It does have the Velcro here. So if you guys do use this for winter camping, I think it would actually be really cool. Other thingy, where is it? Uh, one-handed things. Ah. Oh, there it goes. You can also actually roll it up and then have the thingy over here. So you got two entrances here. Da, there you go. <laughs> I hate Gio. Gio's just chilling. Who say you can get cozy with my husband, your daddy? Sniffing on my jacket. Gio, you like the tent? <laughs> you like the tent, Gio? Okay. Ah, wanna go, daddy? All right, husband, what do you think about this tent? It's pretty spacious. Nobody can hear you. It's pretty spacious. They can hear me. It's no, they sure. really can't. Really? Yeah. It's pretty spacious. So, I think we spent about $40 on it. Oh, excuse the sun. We're, like, directly in the thing. So, if I put the thing on, you're going to see it's red. So, um, technically, we're not really stealth camping because we're not sleeping here. Uh, it's illegal to camp in parks. So, there's no park rangers at all. Oh, wait, let me 
They can't see my husband's face. But let me tell you one thing though. This material is cheap, but it's not as cheap as the Wigman's. That was super freaking cheap. Like this is actually not that bad. All right, Posey, you see any um, giant holes or anything anywhere? The seams look good? The seams look good. Um, the vestibule space is actually really, really spacious. Like, if we... I'm mad. Like, we, we should have took this camping when we had went camping the first time. Like, if we had this t small tent and we had the other small tent, the Wakeman tent for the girls, I think we would have been good. So, while Jean plays with uh, the rest of the stuff, I thought it would be fun if we um, boil some water. Have some coffee, have some tea. I brought little pieces of chicken for Gio because even though he's not drinking um, anything besides water, he should have some chicken. So I'm just really hoping that the cops don't come and really just start messing with us because technically they can. Uh, even though we're not doing anything remotely illegal, but it's the simple fact that it's a closed face tent and they can't see what we're doing. That's my only concern. Okay, so what I'm using to boil the water today is just my little mini um, compact camp stove with my little um, gas can. It's kind of cold, so I'm just hoping the gas doesn't act up and that everything will be fine. All right, I want to make sure the twisty thing was off before I like. see it but it's there I don't can you see it uh, you. you guys see anything there you go you guys see a little bit of that so I'm gonna put this down all the way down right here uh, and then I'm trying really hard not to waste this gas so I'm just gonna put my pot right on there Boil this water. Let's see how long it's gonna take to boil. So we'll be right back. Ah. Okay, so because I was being lazy, this is blowing in. There is sections, the little loopy thingy for me to stake it in, but um not really in the mood for all of that. Want to warm him up with my jacket? You want to lay down in mommy's jacket? He's not going to stay still, but let's see what happens. So I don't know how all the YouTubers take their dogs out for the winter time. I think maybe because they all got long hair, well, long fur. And Gio has really short fur. Sit. Sit down. Sit. All right. Sit. Don't move. Stay. He's just like more comfortable. Is that sitting on the cold floor like I am? I can feel the cold floor. Yeah, I understand. <laughs> you rather be behind me? Yeah, sit down. Sit. There you go. See, isn't that better? No, he wants the warmth of you. <laughs> she was like, "Daddy, warm me up." Okay, come here. Come here. Up. Up. <laughs> What happened? Sit down, Gio. Sit down. Good boy. Good boy, Gio. Okay, so we have all the entrances, well, almost all the entrances open. We got both sides of the vestibule. Like I said, I refuse to stake that down, so that's why it looks like that. You have one window. Two windows plus the other uh, entrance or exit. You have the second window. So, overall, overall, um, I don't think ventilation will be a problem with this. Uh, if we closed everything down, I think we might be a little warm. 
Water is still boiling away. It's been like five whole minutes and I'm getting cold. A cup of coffee is much needed. I think it's like about, babe, what's the temp right now, babe? It's about 40 degrees and I just have my sweater on because I got really hot while we were setting everything up. And uh, so yeah, let's see how long it's gonna take. I'm thinking about maybe 10 minutes. That's what. That's how long it took the last time when me and Ruby was doing this. 10 minutes to boil water. But what is pissing me off though, not about the tent, just in general. The dirt's a little muddy. So the inside of the tent already got dirty and I'm super upset because it's not like we're really, really camping. It's just us fooling around. And then with us rushing out the house, I forgot to bring a ground sheet. A ground tarp sheet, tarp sheet, ground, ground tarp sheet. Y'all know what I mean. All right, so it's literally, literally Christmas day. And you still have people in the park here looking at us like we're freaking retarded. Yes, I understand we're in a public park. Yes, I understand we got a whole tent out. I understand all that. But they're seriously looking at me like I'm completely freaking crazy. Like the looks that I'm getting is ridiculous. Um, so Gene is running around with Gio um, to keep Gio warm because he started shaking. So... I'm sitting here babysitting the water for it to get hot so I can make our tea so then we can pack up and go home because I got what I wanted <laughs> what I wanted was to open this tent and to look at it and to see if I made a um, smart investment or not because <laughs> um, like I said this was I think $40 I will have to double check everything um, my invoices and then so far yes this is cheap but like I said is a lot better than a Wakeman tent uh, I love how spacious it is it says it's a four-person tent but I'm thinking you could probably fit like a full-size air mattress in here and maybe sleep three people comfortably and then all your stuff will be under the vestibule. Um, I wouldn't say four, maybe four children, but not like two adults, two children, or two adults, two teens, um, or four adults, period. Like, I think four children. Four children would be right for this. <sighs> Let me check on that water put on my jacket, it's cold. Okay, so like I said, for drinks, Hubby likes his tea. I got him and his um, cup. His Lipton tea, some powdered milk, and some sugar. And for myself, I have some instant coffee with some milk and sugar in here. Hi, my baby. What's the matter? It's warm now. Gio's running around trying to stay warm, of course. Still waiting on his water. All right, guys, I just noticed something. <laughs> we put it in backwards. So that's supposed to be for when um, you're under the vestibule and then you're supposed to, I guess, put your sneakers on that so you're not tracking dirt into your actual tent. Ugh. Something else. There's always something. I'm always messing up something. It doesn't matter what it is. It's, I need to pay more attention to other stuff as we're setting it up, but it's cold. We were arguing because you wanted to like micromanage and I'm just being like, uh. Wait until I tell him that we put it backwards when he gets over here. Yeah, uh, yeah, that'd be really funny. Hey, babe. I got something to tell you. Uh-oh, here he comes. Wait until I tell him. Gio! Hey, husband. Yes. I just realized something. What did you realize? 
Hey, come over here. <laughs> Let me show you what I realized. So we put this thing backwards. So that's supposed to be, yeah, because then when, um, like if you're setting up for the night and you're going to try to sleep, um, you're supposed to take your shoes off and put your shoes on the mat. That way you don't track dirt into the tent like what we just did. So yeah, that, that kind of makes sense. it does make sense now, doesn't it? Yep. Well, <laughs> until I, next. I thought it was just a skirt. <laughs> did you really? Yeah. No. I guess this is like more for the Asian when you're in the outside outside you leave your shoes out. Yeah. Then you're, it's an Asian thing. Yeah, basically. Deal. Okay, water boiled. So I realized what took it so long. Um, I was trying to be cheap with the propane and uh, had it on super, super low. <laughs> like as if we don't have to go home. Not, it's not like it's super cold out. You know, like whatever. Uh, <laughs> all right let me put my stuff away we're gonna start packing up after we take a few sips of this tea and this coffee i forgot to bring something to stir my coffee so uh i don't know y'all yeah, can see i got lumps of uh, milk and uh and coffee so here husband take your tea thank you wife you're welcome husband oh, the bad thing about this cup <laughs> What is that? It stays hot for too long? No. Remember, this is the one that is in high. If it's hot or cold, you won't feel the warmth. I feel nothing but cold. <laughs> but that means your tea um is going to stay nice and hot. Yeah, but in the hot weather, in the cold weather like this, you want to feel the warmth of the cup like most people do. <laughs> I don't feel the warmth in mine. But that's the whole point. Most people want to, mm, that's a good cup of John. And if it's cold outside, we're like, that's warm. Not me, it's like it's cold. <laughs> yeah, it is pretty cold. My hands are getting super cold. So I'm gonna put my pot away. <sighs> Start heading out because people are beginning to creep me out in the park. Um Yeah. But I did what I wanted to do. I'm happy now. Things you do to make your wife happy are repeating again. Well you better, it's Christmas Day. I was hoping to stay home and just take it easy. You know, like most people are. We're only out here for like an hour. Damn, I should have put this in there. Oh well. Screw that. Yeah, would it fit inside there? It would fit inside. Because no. your cup fit inside there. Oh, you mean inside the thing? Yeah. The inside the pot, yeah. Was that the little propane thing fits in there as well? Yeah. Right. Yeah, you would have put it in there anyway. Yeah, yeah, but it's not like I was just gonna leave it in there. I was just gonna put it in there until we get home. So, uh, but luckily we didn't bring a lot of stuff. It's just an experience. Yeah. See how it looks. Next time though, uh, I would like to be in Pelham and play around with this and actually cook something. But part of Pelham, I'm not gonna tell you. Yeah, no stalkers. <laughs> I don't have stalkers. That's a good thing. I know, I'm not that cute. Mm. Mm. Alright, so while Jean sits here and sip, I'm going to start going outside and uh, put down all the windows. Don't we have Gio who's with the tree? Oh yeah, he's in here. There you go, you can feed him that. He's just watching us like...
phone died towards like the end of me setting everything up but putting everything together was a little bit easier um if my hands were in silk coat did you have fun today babe you mean taking things apart no put things back it was easier if my hands was in silk coat. oh i guess yeah did you have fun today yeah don't lie it <laughs> was it was an experience Freaking sarcastic a hole. I'm so over you. But that's it, guys. That's us fooling around with the Ozark Trail four person tent with the vestibule. It was really cool. I really do like it. What's your verdict on the tent, babe? It was cool. I just want to know if it's actually waterproof or anything like that. Well, we didn't see any holes in the seams. So, most likely, yeah. And this one does have the. Um, the canopy over the whole entire tent, unlike the Wakeman tent. So, mm -hmm. alright guys, that's it from us. Merry Christmas. And a happy new year. Oh my god, I hope you guys enjoy your Christmas. Take care guys. Thank you, bye bye. <laughs>